Tommy, what did you learn from that fight, man? What did it teach you? I went in there, showed the world that I can handle the big stage. And the next time we go again, I'll have this experience behind me and you'll see much better, much better fight next time. What's your message to others, you know, who've, who've been told no, who've been told, you know, doubted? What's your message to them? For the past two and a half years, everyone said I was ducking from this guy. I pulled out twice before. I showed everyone that I wasn't, I wasn't pulling out. There was no ducking. I came over in my team. I said I was going to win all week. I'm standing here the winner. And what's your message to your loved ones, man? Especially, you know, baby back home, missus back home. What's your message to them? This fight tonight was dedicated to my little girl at home. You know, I'm not spent any time with her really. I've been constantly training in a training camp. I'm ready to go back home and enjoy some father time now. What do you think about the fight? Talk to us, talk us through it. Yeah, uh, yeah, those are young, tough kids. Obviously, didn't go our way, which sucks. But I've been there. So this is my brother, and I'm gonna be there for him. Um, win or lose, I love him more than anyone on the planet. What advice would you give to him? I, mean, I, I gave him the advice, like take it on the chin, be humble, and work harder to be better. Like. Uh, you would be surprised how much failure and loss can contribute to the most amounts of tremendous growth in your life. And he got to just, he got to realize that. And this is the first time he's going to, he's going to really feel that. He's going to get that opportunity to climb that mountain again because he's, he's not at the bottom, but damn, he definitely you. fell a little bit. What advice would you give to your younger self? Follow your dreams and never say never because everything's possible. I've just seen tonight. Tommy, three or four years ago, wasn't even a professional. Today, he topped the bill with 10,000 people with the world watching, the world's biggest star, Ronaldo, me. Mike Tyson was all here, so. And what's your message to the world? World peace, world peace. Advice your younger self, bro. Pick another sport. <laughs> why is that, honestly though, why? No, no, no. No, fight of the years uh, is not good for your head, but it's, I'm a fighter and I'll fight to the end, so yeah. Sometimes it's rough and tough. If it was easy, everybody would do it. Advice to my younger self, um, choose a great advisor, money advisor and um, protect your heart around the people that, that say they love you. Message to the world? To the world. More love, less hate. Let's go. If you could have fight. Jake Paul put up a great fight. It was a lot better than I thought he was. He, he has a great team, he proved it. Tommy had to dig deep, he took some thunderous shots, but it was a great fight. It, they got to it, they, went, they said they was gonna go to war, and they went to war. And what? Be proud of both boys. Advice. Fight again, rematch. What's your message to the young people? Realistically, what you need to do is sit down and just like reevaluate like what you do, because that's what I did. I used to just go with the flow of things and just see where like life took me. But if you kind of like sit down and actually structure what you want to do, have structure in your life, it will do numbers for you. Trust me. What advice would you give to your younger self? Stay away from girls. <laughs> girls are the biggest distraction. Like, such a massive distraction. Oh my gosh. It will happen. Like, just, just go with the flow. Don't chase a girl. A girl will find you.